Alright, so now we got Hyrule here. And all these different uh, medallions will take us to different places. So let's uh, check out this uh, purple medallion here. Yeah, this takes us over here. See what happens when we go over here. Okay, it takes us back. Oh, nice shot. I think it's Lake Hylia. Really cool map, really well done. Like, I like, I like the waterfall is moving and everything, and they have so much of Ocarina of Time in this map here. Oh wow, they even have this whole fishing area too. Like, they just have so much of Ocarina of Time in this one map, it's pretty impressive. Yeah, I guess we have the entrance to the water temple over here. Let's see where this takes us. Takes us back here. Oh, we even have uh, the mass shop over here. And they even have all the masks like moving around and everything. The fact that they made all these doors work. Like this one, yeah. <laughs> we can see all the items here moving around. This area here is actually like a mini game. Because usually this would be the bomb shoot game. It's really cool. Oh wow, we got a piece of heart for doing that. <laughs> it's so cool that they made like these shooting games work and everything. These actually uh, take you places. <laughs> that is sick. That is so cool. Oh, there's so much to explore here. Like, it'd be crazy if you had like a full like 32 team server on this or if they use this map as like a hundred person like Battle Royale or something. But yeah, I guess this is all taken from Ocarina of Time 3D also, so that's how they got the models, and that's probably why it looks so good also. Wow, yeah. This room with all the pots. Take a break. <laughs> oh, wow. <laughs> Takes us over here. To the fish. We have Fairy Fountain over here, too. It actually heals you and has an effect and everything. We have this place with, like, the tunics and everything, and the fish. Found somebody! <laughs> Alright, let's head to Kakiri Forest here. I just honestly can't believe that they have everything in here. Like, this is honestly just insane. Even this area here. <laughs> Alright, yeah, we got the forest temple here. Wonder what happens when you go through that. Probably you to get taken back. Lost Woods over here. This is like legitimately the Lost Woods, <laughs> so you have to know the right path. No, it's, it's pretty insane that they have like everything. Wow, well, we can just jump over here. Let's go, uh, let's try out this medallion, nice. Oh wow, we have this little area here and everything. Oh wow, we got the uh, Gerudo Fortress over here. Wow, we actually have all these rooms and everything. What is the scope of this? It's just insane. Yo, Litronom, what's up? You're the one that made this map, right? Nice, man. Like, how long did this take you? Like, this is insane. And I like your unusual, man. It looks sick. Four to five years? Wow. This is just insane, the scope of this hack. It's pretty much everything in TF2 in here, and like, all the little mini games and everything. Like, I'm honestly so impressed by this. Like, just the fact that you got everything in here. Like, I've been exploring this for like half an hour, and there's still a bunch of areas that I haven't explored yet. So, this is honestly just insane. 
Oh wait, yeah, let's check out some secrets. I don't think it's gonna change yet, but it's gonna change at the end of the round, which I don't think is gonna happen. Yeah, I'll follow you around for a bit. <laughs> Alright, yeah, let's check this out. Check out the secret. Oh, over here. Oh! Oh, nice! Got some fairy fountain! This is sick! <laughs> Oh, if you collect all three stones, you actually open the door. That's sick. <laughs> that is so cool. Okay, let's uh, try to open this door here then. Yeah, we're on the quest to find the stone. So to find the stones, does it have to be one person or can we do it as a team? Like as long as three people get them? Do the Deku Tree one. Alright, we can do this guys. Let's get all three stones and <laughs> open the temple of time here. But no, like honestly, this is just so insane, Lich, and I'm so glad that you're in this server right now. Like I was hoping that you joined one of these, because obviously you're probably pretty big into TF2 making all these maps and stuff. And just the fact that, like, you're making custom, uh, Mario Kart 64 maps too, like, very talented. Okay, I, I got the first stone, I got the green stone. Oh, it actually counts as the intelligence too? Yeah, but judging by your unusuals, you must have played TF2 a fair bit though, right? Litronama, I'm sure you probably sunk a bunch of hours in on this game. Eight years? Nice. Yeah, I've started playing in 2010, so yeah, I've got a good... Like, ten years on this game, but... You know, I've been a huge fan of TF2 for over 10,000 hours. Wow, that's impressive. I have, I think, just over 1,000 hours. Oh yeah, that's exactly when I was started playing around Soldier Demo Man War also. Yeah, map making and trading. How do I deposit the intelligence legend on them here? Is, is anybody oh, even never mind, I just did it. Okay. Got one of the stones, just need the other two. No, it's weird, I just played through Mark Kirkle's hack, Jiggies of Time, so... When I'm playing this, I'm thinking of Jiggies of Time more than I'm thinking of, like, Ocarina of Time. I honestly only ever did one playthrough, or... I did a playthrough of Ocarina of Time, then did the Master Quest version, so I honestly don't have that much uh, Ocarina of Time knowledge. Oh god, Kakariko Village here. She got the windmill moving and everything. Yeah, like, I honestly I cannot believe the scope of this map, Vultranom. Like, you really went above and beyond. Wow, I'm opening this gate here by Kakariko Village and everything. Like, this is so cool. Oh, what's your question, Ashabot? Before you put in the last stone, you want to let me know, I just want to get it, like, the footage of the door opening. Oh, what happened to the Spongebob video? Um, Nintendo took it down, or no, Spongebob took it down. Well, not Spongebob, but the company that owns Spongebob took down that video. So that's where that video went. Yeah, it got taken down by, by uh, Viacom, yeah. Yeah, I think Viacom took it down. So you think, uh, I'm not sure. Okay, second one. Where's the third stone? We just need the Jabu stone, or like the water stone, I should call it. I think that's what it's called. <laughs> oh, I'm in Goron City right now. I'm probably close to it. Wait. Okay, I'm going into the secret place by this Goron that's probably... No. Alright. You can lead the way to the stone, Litronom, if you want. <laughs> Honestly, do not know where it is. Oh! Oh wow, I can actually blow up that rock. I can't believe like, the hearts actually heal you and everything too, that's so cool. Even like all the bombs are functional and everything. This is sick. There it is, the last stone. <laughs> all right, the Chanam, feel free to deposit the last stone. I'm excited. That is so cool. This wow. That is so sick! Wow, 
Wow, yeah, you get a custom Link hat. That is, that is so cool. Wow, every one of these gives you a different Link hat. That is so cool. <laughs> no way, that is sick. Wow, even all these secrets. Probably not many people have been in this area before, you know? Oh, this is the credits room? That is so cool. So glad we got, like, the actual map maker here. <laughs> and I'm glad people are coming into the server too, so... You can have, like, the spiders and everything animated? That's so sick! Oh nice, this boss fight room. Oh wow, yeah, the credits. Original assets, Ocarina of Time, modeling, film and taco, asset provision, robo tortoise, then general development, litronom. General advice testing, sweep. And that's it for this map here. Huge shout outs to Litronom for making this, obviously, did just an amazing job. And thank you guys for checking out this video. If you could leave a like or maybe consider subscribing to the channel, I would greatly, greatly appreciate it. And I hope that you all have a great day.